Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel, and I hope everyone is doing well today. And guys, as you can see by the title and the thumbnail, Call of Duty is dead. That's what we're going to be talking about here today. But before we dive in, guys, we are almost to 300 subscribers, and I appreciate every single one of you. So if you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Drop a like on the video because it always helps with the algorithm and it is greatly appreciated. And without any further ado, guys, let's just get straight into the video. So guys, when I say Call of Duty is dead, I don't mean that the player base has dropped so low that this game is going to die. People are still going to keep playing Call of Duty. It's going to be that way for a very long time. I mean, it's Call of Duty. But the point that I'm trying to make is, is everything that we used to love about Call of Duty is completely gone. And with the shutdown of X Defiant, now Call of Duty has absolutely no competition to try and force the devs to improve their game. Now, don't get me wrong, guys. With X Defiant, there is no way in any universe that that game was ever going to kill Call of Duty. But it did offer a glimmer of hope that it would force Call of Duty to try and make their game better. I mean, look at what's happening already. Everything in this game is pretty much AI driven, okay? If you swear too much in this game, if you use the word fuck one too many times, you're going to get chat banned. But they will allow a skin for a gun to promote drug use, which makes absolutely no sense to me. And this game is supposed to be a fast-paced arcade military shooter based on the Cold War. I don't understand why they have to put unicorn skins in the game. It doesn't make any sense to me. All the stuff that they're doing is like they're trying to copy Fortnite. I don't get it. So guys, basically all I'm saying is, is everything that we used to know and love about Call of Duty is gone. The devs do not care. Activision does not care. If you think that they're going to take this game and turn it around and give it a huge overhaul, you are sadly mistaken. This is what Call of Duty has become. This is what we get to look forward to every year from this point on. It's just an absolute joke. And in closing, guys, I just want to say that everything that they add into the game as the game progresses over the years, the movement, the guns, and everything, that's all good. They're very good at putting new things into the game and trying to be innovative. But the manipulation in the background, all the bullshit that they prioritize, the store over everything else, it's killing the game. That is what, no matter what they put into the game, that is always going to kill it. So guys, with that, I'm just going to end the video here, but I want to know your thoughts on this. So leave a comment down in the comment section below and let me know what you guys think about everything that's going on with Call of Duty right now. And if you guys did stick around till the end of the video, I thank you very much for watching. And as always, guys, I'll just catch you in the next one. I'm out of here. Peace.